Hi guys! Welcome back to my YouTube channel. And for today's video, we tackle about divisibility rule for 3, 6, and 9. First rule, divisibility rule for 3. A whole number is divisible by 3 if the sum of all the digits is divisible by 3. So, let's give an example. Is 342 divisible by 3? So, we're going to add the digits. 3 plus 4 plus 2 equals 9. Then, 9 divide 3 equals 3. Therefore, 342 is divisible by 3. Another example. Is 546 divisible by 3? Add the digits again. 5 plus 4 plus 6 equals 15. Then, 15 divide 3 equals 5. Therefore, 546 is divisible by 3. Another example to make it clear. Is 822 divisible by 3? So add the digits again. 8 plus 2 plus 2 equals 12. Then 12 divide 3 equals 4. So therefore, 822 is divisible by 3. Another rule. Divisibility rule for 6. The prime factors of 6 are 2 and 3. So for a number to be divisible by 6, it must also be divisible by 2 and 3. Therefore, we need to check if a number is even and then check if the sum of the digits is divisible by 3. So it means dapat it must be divisible by 2 and 3. Dapat na-comply yung dalawa. Okay, example. Is 126 divisible by 6? 126 can be divided by 2 as the ones digit. 6 is even number. Is 126 divisible by 3? So, we need to add the digits again. 1 plus 2 plus 6 equals 9. Then, 9 divide 3 equals 3. So, is 126 divisible by 6? So, for the rule number 2, since 6 is even number, then the first criteria is checked. And for rule number 3, since the sum is 9, it is divisible by 3, then check again. So, for rule number 6, since the two criteria is meet, then it must also check. So therefore, we conclude that 126 is divisible by 6. Another example, is 741 divisible by 6? 741 cannot be divided by 2 as the ones digit, 
one is odd number. Is 741 divisible by three? So add the digits again, seven plus four plus one equals 12. Then 12 divide three equals four. Is 741 divisible by six? So for all number two, since one is add number, then for all number two, x. Hindi niya na comply kasi hindi siya divisible by two. And for all number three, the sum is 12. 12 is divisible by three, then for all number three is check. But for all number six, since the two criteria hindi niya na met, so 741 is not divisible by 6. So extra. And now we conclude that 741 is not divisible by 6. Okay, another example to make it clear. Is 862 divisible by 6? 862 can be divided by 2 as the ones digit 2 is even number. Is 862 divisible by 3? So we're going to add the digits again. 8 plus 6 plus 2 equals 16. Then 16 divide 3 equals 5 remainder 1. Is 862 divisible by 6? For all number 2, since 2 is even number, then check. And for all number 3, since the sum is 16, 16 is not divisible by 3, then x. And for all number 6, since the 2 criteria does not meet, then x. Yung kanina example, yung for all number 2, yung hindi niya na met. Pero na met niya yung for all number 3. At this time, magkabaliktad siya. Na met niya yung for all number 2, but for all number 3 naman yung hindi. So now, therefore, 862 is not divisible by 6. Okay? Klaro naman na yun, no? Let's go. Let's go forward. Divisibility rule for 9. A whole number is divisible by 9 if the sum of all the digits is divisible by 9. Example, is 873 divisible by 9? So, add the digits again. 8 plus 7 plus 3 equals 18. Then, 18 divide 9 equals 2. So, therefore, 873 is divisible by 9. Another example. Is 918 divisible by 9? So, same again, same process, 9 plus 1 plus 8 equals 18. Then, 18 divide 9 equals 2. So, therefore, 918 is divisible by 9. Another example, is 612 divisible by 9? 6 plus 1 plus 2 equals 9. Then, 9 divide 9 equals 
1. So, therefore, 612 is divisible by 9. So, that's all. I hope na intindihan nyo yung lecture natin today. And don't forget to like and subscribe. Thank you!